There are four types of transformations, three of which are isometries. One of these is a translation. So a translation is an isometry that slides or moves all of the points on a figure in the same direction. So let's say I gave names to my three vertices in this triangle. Let's call this A, B, and C. So notice, if I go in a clockwise direction, after A follows B, after B follows C, after C follows A. When I translate this, that orientation is going to stay the same. We're still going to have A then B, B then C, and C then A. But how do we describe a translation to other mathematicians? Well, to do that, we're going to write an expression kind of like this, which says the original coordinates, whatever they are, x and y, are being mapped onto a new image. So this tells me to take every x-coordinate of this triangle and add 1 to it. it. Tells me to take every y coordinate of this triangle and subtract 2. So you're going to use this rule to find which way you're going to translate. When you're adding to an x, you're going to be shifting your figure to the right. When you're subtracting from x, you're going to shift your figure to the left. When y is being added to, you're going to shift your figure up. And when y is being subtracted, it'll shift your figure down. So keep that in mind when you have problems that are asking you to translate an image.